Typically, we bring you stories on what's going on in Mesquite ISD and the local community. But today, we are going to highlight our successes this year in the advanced audio video production and practicum classes. In addition to CTE organization competitions, our class also participated in the 10th annual Mesquite ISD Film Festival. Here are this year's winners in the advanced video production category. For the MISD Film Festival this year, we placed first, second, and third. For our third place, it was our Red On Demand, which was our regional competition for TSA. Our second one was Stand Up, which was our state level qualifier for TSA On Demand. And then for first place, it was our short film called Poop News about a new studio crew uh, just trying to make ends meet. It, and just the craziness of it all. It was basically a mockumentary. Uh, it was inspired by The Office and Parks and Recreation. And so we tried to make it goofy and like comedic, which I think we succeeded at that. Uh, it's a little cringy, but you know, uh, it gets the job done. I mean, like, that's kind of how mockumentaries are. I played a character called Whitney Houston, and it definitely made me step out of my box more. Definitely not how I actually am. Shut up, shut up. What's wrong with Brittany? <laughs> he yelled at me. <laughs> yo, yo, hey, hey, hey. Quit crying, I'll take you to Cracker Barrel after this. <laughs> chicken fried steak. Yeah, you get the chicken fried steak. I love Cracker Barrel. My daddy used to take me there all the time. Well, before he shot himself in the foot. But it was fun to play and it was great winning first place because I feel like that what we deserved it with the hard work we put into the film. It was a different experience because it wasn't, it was more of the office filming, I guess you could say. It wasn't traditional filmmaking, which made it harder yet easier to film. Hey, we're, we're rolling. Oh, we are? Okay. Yeah. Uh, so my name is Brad Pennington. I'm a co-anchor for uh, Plainsville, Oklahoma Original Production News. The news channel is a pretty big deal around these parts, mostly because we only have like three channels, but that's besides the point. The main point I'm trying to make here is that I'm super famous here. It was really fun to be able to just um, take it slow and sit back and just let the camera do the work. Here's the script for today's show. Yeah, I don't need that. Um, Eric, I think we should add like the feminist movements of it happening. We can put it right here. Hmm. You know, bring attention to it. Yeah, you know what? That's a great idea. You know what I think you should do? You should run that by our executive producer right over there. Oh, sure. Our second place film, Stand Up, um, that one was about like a failing comedian who's like scared to go to the talent show the next day and, he, and like he's really bad at like being a comedian like his jokes are really horrible and that was really fun because I was like actually one of the actors like the main actor in it it was really goofy because we had to have like the camera right in my face and stuff like that and so and it looked really aesthetically pleasing with color grading and all that stuff so it looked really professional to me and to everyone else I believe and I was really happy with my acting and the final outcome of it Hey, so, uh, my wife's divorcing me, and she's taking the kids. Yeah, uh, she didn't oh, just take so the kids. Bad. This she is absolutely house, terrible. Just car. Joke's on her. I took her paper whisk. You suck. Yeah. Not to brag, but I've been avoiding people. Probably because she took everything from me. <laughs> European. <laughs> Get it? So for third place, our film, or On Demand, Red, um, was a murder mystery um, inspired by Sin City. With, and you'll know that when you look at it because the only color that pops up is red, everything else is in black and white. And so we used a kind of a voiceover type, the same thing that Sin City used. And I really liked filming it and especially editing it because I just think it was really cool of how like just the red popping out the whole time because I've never like done that type of effect before. And I was, really, I was really pleased with the final outcome. It was very fun to film. We got to film at uh, numerous locations, including a library. And even in our studio, we used the lights to like an extent that we have not used them before. And it really made the video stand out in terms of creativity and lighting. My name is Detective Riley. I've been on the hunt for the dog ever since he got my wire. But today I finally have a lead. Hey.
a business card. To win the top three, it was really nice because it felt like all our hard work was finally coming together and recognized. The film festival was a really great experience. I got to um, be creative with script writing and be creative with uh, the way I told a story. And I got the Viewer's Choice Award. I was a little bit disappointed that I didn't make the top three finalists, but either way, I still think I made a really good video. Excuse me, miss. This was the first time I ever met her just three feet between us. I knew nothing about her. 18 hours later, I fell in love with this woman. She had that same look in her eyes as that intern, full of hope and excitement. I couldn't say no, and there was nothing more to lose. We finished doing our laundry, but we kept talking. I've never been to the city before, so I asked him to take me. So, we went. A little fun can sometimes be the remedy for the worst situations. This wraps up our stories for the day. Our stories typically cover people and events related to our audience in Mesquite ISD or the local community. If you like our news program and have a story suggestion for future episodes, please submit it here at tinyurl.com forward slash mscbnews. If you would like to stay current with what's going on in the Mesquite ISD Advanced Audio Video Production and Practicum program and our stories, please subscribe to our Mesquite Student Entertainment and Broadcasting YouTube channel. Like us on Facebook and Instagram and follow us on Twitter. Thank you for joining us today. I'm Yuvia De Mata. Until next time, have a great summer. This has been a presentation of MSEB. Mesquite Student Entertainment and Broadcasting in association with the Mesquite Independent School District Career and Technical Education Department.